This uniquely beautiful chemical reaction is how we made mirrors for hundreds of years, and it's creatively called the silver mirror reaction. This reaction is done using only a few ingredients, but unfortunately one of those ingredients is the incredibly expensive silver nitrate. Luckily, silver nitrate can be produced fairly easily by dissolving silver in nitric acid. However, it does produce a lot of incredibly toxic nitrogen dioxide fumes, which are really not safe to breathe. This can be reduced somewhat by using more dilute acid, but in general I don't recommend trying this unless you really know what you're doing. Honestly, I don't really think the average person has concentrated nitric acid anyway, so it might be a moot point. Anyway, as the silver dissolves, you might notice the solution become a little bit cloudy, and that's totally normal. This is caused by minor chloride impurities in my water, which forms the incredibly insoluble silver chloride. I went ahead and removed the silver chloride by passing the solution through a fritted funnel a few times, and then boiled down the resulting filtrate. Once the volume had reduced significantly, I placed my beaker on ice to crystallize my pure silver nitrate. This chemical forms in beautiful translucent platelets, and it's one of the few soluble silver salts. As a final step, these crystals are collected by vacuum filtration and desiccated for a few days until they're completely dry. They can then be stored in pretty much any non-metal container for any amount of time until you're ready to use them. As a final word of warning, just make sure silver nitrate never comes in contact with alcohol, or it'll form the incredibly dangerous silver fulminate. Silver fulminate can be decomposed by hydrochloric acid into cyanide, but that's not really much safer. Anyway, now that I had my silver nitrate, I could finally make my silver mirror. To keep these videos short, I'm going to do that in a separate part, so give me a follow and check back in a few hours if you're interested.